Hey guys, welcome to Diorama update number 16, I believe is what it is. Today we are going to be doing a quick little video. Uh, I've got a four day weekend this weekend and I just finished my Tiger Tank 114 in Normandy diorama. And let me tell you, I am so proud of this one. Uh, I'm super excited, partially because I got this photo booth. Now this particular one is too small. I read the dimensions wrong online. And I ordered a new one, which will be here tomorrow, that's a bit bigger. So I'll be able to take pictures of my tank by itself. But uh, give you guys a quick little sneak peek. Battle for Normandy, 102nd SS Heavy Tank Regiment Tiger 114 south of Kane, near Colville. That's the tank itself. Knocked out. The story goes, basically, they got ambushed by British uh, anti-tank guns, and he actually, the driver ran into a tank in front of it and broke the, I think it was a drive sprocket, and they had to abandon the tank. But I'll show some pictures that I took in the photo booth, and you'll kind of see why I'm getting a different one. It's a little small, but just give you guys some details to look out for in the video that'll come tomorrow. The rust details, you got round impacts, two different ricochets, hand painted splinter camo, it's like a tarp. Super happy with how this thing came out. I took my time on this one every time I got a little flustered and wanted to finish early rush it i stopped what i was doing and went and did something else and it paid off so super exciting there'll be a video up tomorrow uh two different videos actually one will be of the tiger standalone in the photo booth and then the other one will be black backdrop morning sunlight of the actual diorama uh yeah so Hey, so apparently my video cut out and I didn't realize it, but these are the photos I told you guys about. I took in the small booth. Uh, sometime tomorrow in the afternoon, we'll get that bigger booth. I'll be able to take better photos. I'll upload a standalone just like this. More detail, longer lasting photos, uh, things like that. But that's the finished Tiger Tank. Pretty happy with how it came out. Took my time on it. And, uh... Patience definitely paid off. So I was really happy with that tarp too. About to show y'all here in a moment the camo pattern I was going for. It's that uh, the splinter camo, and uh, here are the steps I took to do it. First, uh, that tan, then the brown, then the green, and then the green lines. And Shit, yep, that's, that's about it for that. Here's the uh, Hello Loose gameplay. Here we were engaging a Tiger Tank with a uh, 74 millimeter Sherman, and we somehow destroyed it. Um, obviously, we're shooting a, the engine block, and uh, he almost took us out. As you can see there, he definitely took out our turret, or at least uh, the rotating part. Thank God we're already looking at him. But and, uh, next here, we were in a. Uh, Easy 8, 76 jumbo, solid panther coming out. Ping here, it was like 700 meters, I think, roughly around there. And high velocity 76 millimeter gun, just one shot killed this guy. Uh, got a good gunner too, so that definitely helps. Uh, next, we were in, literally right after that, is a uh, 76 jumbo in, against a tiger tank. Two separate clips because I uh, recorded the first one, then we moved the tank across the road. And you can see that tiger tank there. He saw us right when he, we saw him. First hit ricocheted. Then he said one at us, and it was short. Just short. And uh, that next round went out in high velocity, 76 millimeter penetrated that armor, and got him in one shot. So. Uh, next up, I think this is the last one. Looked on the map here. I was getting online with our other 76 Jumbo. Trying to hold that one point. And yeah, I saw a light-skinned vehicle on the map from a recon. So I was taking a look. And it was a German supply truck. So it was 
easy kill right there. He's trying to set up a garrison so they could spawn. But no, we denied that shit. Oh, actually not last. Uh, on Utah Beach, we were in the Tiger Tank again and uh, engaging a 76 Jumbo. He didn't know where we were at. Uh, two shots, I think it took to take him out. He was pretty close though, so. Anyways guys, hope you all enjoyed the update. Uh, look forward to those videos coming soon.